Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today was supposed to be a master bedroom makeover, but then I got sidetracked and decided to paint the entire bathroom. So if you are new here, my name is Lori Nicholson. I love to do all things homemaking, so cooking, cleaning, decorating, and DIY. And I would love it if you would subscribe to my channel. If you're returning, it is so great to see you. I cannot wait to jump into this video. I feel like sometimes my mind squirrels when I am in the middle of doing one thing and my mind's like, nope, we're gonna do something else. So I'm gonna take you along on this crazy journey with with me. Okay guys, today we are going to spring clean the master. I have new bedding for this bed. I also want to clean all this off. My life is a mess. I have a humongous exciting project I'm going to share with you too. The kids have been playing in here. They were randomly out of school for two days due to a issue that had nothing to do with kids. It's like school related stuff. And um, I wanted to put our furniture back out. This is kind of like where I sit in the morning and have coffee. And I got a new chicken coop. So I hope to build that today. They are finishing it over there. Um, there's like a door you can see. I'll take you guys out there in another day, maybe later today when I finish this, because I got quite a big project to do here. So again, just gonna clean all this up. I wanna go through all the drawers, get everything cleaned up. And then we're gonna come in here. I want to take everything out of here because I am going to paint these cabinets and I think I'm gonna paint the tile. We are going to be gutting this bathroom next year. I don't want to do it right now. I just want to get the house like somewhat livable. And then I shouldn't say livable. I want to get the house like, you know, looking nice and peaceful, but we'll come in here and gut all this. Uh, I just, I just don't want to do it right now. So we are going to paint using my favorite paint kits. So, um, we'll do that. I was going to do the shower, but I probably won't. I don't know. I don't know. So what we need to do is clean the master get all of this stuff out of here and get it ready to paint. So that's what we have on the deck today and let's get into it. Some of the new bedding came from Target. I actually got some new pillows and also my monthly Ritual shipment, which I want to say thank you to Ritual for sponsoring today's video. I absolutely love this product. You guys know I've talked about it many, many times on my channel. I've been taking Ritual, I want to say for maybe two, three years now. If you guys aren't familiar with Ritual, they are an incredible vitamin company that is vegan friendly, non-GMO, gluten-free, major allergen-free, without any extra artificial ingredients in them. They are designed to support foundational health with key nutrients to support both the brain health, which I talk about a lot, bone health, blood building, and antioxidant support. I also love that this is clinically backed and it is a multivitamin that has high quality key ingredients that are completely traceable. If you go onto their website, you will be able to see exactly where all the ingredients come from. And it is third-party tested, which is great to make sure that all of the things that you are ingesting are at the highest quality. I currently take the Essential Women's 18 Plus. I am 38 years old and I take this every single morning. It has a delay release capsule, which is designed to dissolve later in the small intestines, which is an ideal place for absorption. I also take Rituals Symbiotic Plus, which is a three-in-one prebiotic, probiotic, and postbiotic supplement designed to support gut, digestive, and immune health. I really like this, especially as I travel. I find that it keeps my body regular and it always creates a much easier way to digest food throughout the week. I love that both of these capsules have a delicious minty flavor. No matter how hard we try to stay balanced with our diets, there's no way we can all get enough from food alone, so having a vitamin um, like the Essential Women's 18 and the Symbiotic Plus are great ways to fill those common gaps that are found in so many of us today. Plus, it is delivered straight to your door, so you never have to worry about running low. If you guys want to start a ritual that you can feel good about, Ritual is offering us 20% off during your first month by visiting ritual.com slash lnicholson20 and using code lnicholson20 for 20% off your first month. If you guys are not sure which ones to take, definitely head over to their website using the link below in the description box to find what fits your needs best. Thank you again to Ritual for sponsoring today's video and making a vitamin we can all trust. Okay guys, let's jump into today's video. Mm -hmm. 
For the last couple months, I've wanted to clean out this drawer. For whatever reason, it's become another catch-all in our house, and it's just got a bunch of random stuff in it. So I'm gonna take everything out. Things I really like to keep by my bedside are a lot of times my chargers. I have some room sprays that are nice for kind of like winding down at the end of the day. I usually keep a, my our bedside Bible in here, and then like some rosaries I've collected since I was little. And then I'm gonna keep our remote in here. And then I also use cough drops throughout the night. Sometimes lately we just, with the allergies, I've been having on and off coughing and then also earplugs because I have a, I'm a very, very light sleeper and I have had the hardest time sleeping recently. So I like to always keep little earplugs by my bedside and then also my night vitamin as well. So I'm gonna get all of that kind of organized and put back into this drawer. Now that the drawer is all organized, I wanna just do a nice a deep clean. So we're just gonna clean around all the spaces where I open and close this drawer and just get all the dust off and get it nice and clean. Tell me in the comments down below, how have you guys been doing? What's new? Are you guys enjoying the spring season? We were supposed to have a beautiful weekend for Easter and 80s and now it's going to be raining and cold. It's been a very cold, rainy spring for us and I am really looking forward to being out and about this spring and summer. But tell me in the comments down below, what do you guys been up to? I love keeping this master bedroom very clean. And while I'm cleaning, I just keep thinking to myself how much I wanna create a very relaxing space that I can come to at night or when I wake up in the morning and just really transform like the bathroom into a more spa-like feeling, as well as this space in my bedroom. I do have some new sheets and things that we're gonna be putting on today, but um, I definitely share way more over on my Instagram. If you guys want to join me there at Miss is Lauren Nicholson. I shared everything that goes on during my days in my stories as well as, you know, reels and things like that. So I did not share this bathroom transformation over there yet. So if you are joining me because I told you to come see this, hi and welcome. Don't forget to subscribe. Uh, but I kind of use the two platforms interchangeably to share up to the minute things on Instagram because uh, sometimes it takes me time to cut these videos and do the voiceovers and get them up online. So definitely head over there and join me and follow my Mrs. Lauren Nicholson page as well as subscribing here.
The last thing I want to do is kind of pick up around this room and then get all of the bedding put into the washer machine and we'll come back in here at the end of the day. At this point I had full visions of doing the carpet and um, uh, vacuuming part of this bed where the cat hangs out has like cat hair on it. I wanted to like vacuum all that but I literally can't stop thinking about the bathroom. Like the more I spend time in this room staring at that bathroom I just want to paint it. So um, I end up just taking uh, all the bedding throwing it in the washing machine and then we are going to head into the bathroom and declutter everything um, I thought maybe I'd just declutter it and then maybe next week do the painting, but you guys know me, I can't help. I just want to redo everything and I had the paint there, so I really genuinely want to just get the bathroom done so then I can actually do a real genuine remake, like uh, makeover in the bedroom and bathroom at the same time. So we're gonna do a little decluttering and then we're gonna get started on painting. to let all of that I use like a wet washcloth to kind of wipe everything down to prep before I paint um, and again I use the type of paint that doesn't require sanding priming or any of that stuff but you do want to wipe down like any of the dust and oils that are on there but I wanted to take a little second come out here and put my uh, little seating arrangement back out here uh, it we do it's freezing cold here I shouldn't say freezing that's um, but it's cold for me. Uh, it's in the like 55 here, so it's kind of chilly. But um, I do like sitting out here and doing my meditations in the morning. And because we had this huge rainstorm, I moved all of it. But now I just kind of want to get it put back. Uh, we'll definitely be changing out this area as summer kind of unfolds. But for now, I just want to make it nice so I can start to use it again. All right guys, bathroom is clean. I wiped everything down. And like I said, I'm not sure if I'm gonna paint the tile or not. Um, I've never painted tile before, but I painted granite, so. Yeah? Okay, I'm back. So I cleaned the entire bathroom. I cleaned the tile, cleaned everything here, moved everything out of the way. So we are 100% painting these white, same uh, bright white from Beyond Paint. And then they also have a tile paint. Um, I was thinking of slapping on here, um, but I'm not sure because, I mean, I don't mind this, uh, but again, I've, I've never painted tile. We painted with the granite and that turned out nice. Um, but I ordered what they said would be enough to do the shower, the, all of this tile, uh, but I also want to do the floor too. I know that sounds a little cray cray, but so here's my vis. My vis is to paint the, I'm gonna do the tile up here first and then see how that turns out and make sure I have enough. Then I will, so this will all be white. Then I'll paint the cabinets and I'll do the floor absolutely very last. And I don't know if I'm gonna have enough for that. But we're going to we're going to do this together. It's going to take a couple days. I'll take you guys along the way with me day to day and then I'll also do a um a how to video after I learn all the things. Hi, Chewie. Um but yeah. All right, guys. Let's get started. I think now I've got my stuff in the washing machine going, so I'm going to get the Beyond Paint kind of lay things out and see what Hey, okay, guys. I'm officially ready to get started. I changed into my paint clothes and I changed my nails out because my other nails were very long and I just need them to be a little bit shorter because they're kind of driving me crazy. I will link these down below. They're my favorite. They're reusable. 
and I just think they do a really good job with this company. So first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna test out right here. And um, yeah, 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 that's what I think I'm gonna do. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna do the shower. I think I am. I think we should do it. Let's do the shower. Okay, I'm gonna pick the shower. Um, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna start up high and then we'll go down low. So we'll just keep doing that. The floor will be the last thing that I do. And um, yeah, <laughs> I hope this turns out good. All right guys, let's get the <laughs> about this paint on my channel quite a bit. I redid my uh, kitchen with this paint and I also redid our laundry room with it. It's a great option if you guys are looking for a um, really beautiful but easy paint redo or remodel in your house. I love using this. I typically don't like doing paint projects because I hate the sanding, prepping, priming. It just takes days and days and days and this paint does all of that for you. It's also self-settling so when we go to uh, do this it'll take me two days to finish this bathroom. But when we're finished, it has a sealer on it that will give this an, the tile a nice high gloss and it will also self settle, so it's perfect. Um, if you guys are looking for a, some great paint for your next project, I will link this down in the description box below. These cabinets are the same ones we had in the kitchen, same ones we have in the uh, laundry room, so they will need three coats. The uh, tile looks pretty good, not gonna lie. Um, I was low-key thinking about not doing this floor, but I just, I just hate it. Um, so I am gonna paint it. I just need to figure out how I'm gonna do that. I might need a bigger roller. But here is where we're at now. This is pretty much dried. Let's see how this is doing. Yeah, this is all dry, so we can start going the second coat and keep moving it along. Okay guys, we are officially done with two coats. I ended up doing the shower and I'm definitely doing the floor because, yeah. So I have two coats on all the cabinets and two coats on the tile. The tile actually looks pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. What are you doing, Kitty? Don't you jump on those counters. Don't do, don't do it. Do not do it. Anyway, so we'll need one more coat on everything. Um, I was hoping this was gonna be a two coater, but you can tell there's some 
variation in a couple places and then over here there's just a couple spots so to make it perfect we're gonna do one more coat and then we'll seal it but it's looking very good can't wait So here's where we're at. I did the floor. <laughs> it looks like dentures in here. It's too white. But again, we're going to add a bunch of decor and we're going to change the vibe. We're just kind of like giving it a nice clean white palette and then we're going to jazz it up with all kinds of stuff. So I am going to head into the kitchen, have some dinner, and then we're going to come back and clean all this up and make the bed. made the bed I turned it down for my husband and I and the bathroom's looking much better we have a lot of work to do tomorrow but obviously the things I wanted to do in today's video didn't happen but at least took my vitamins and I want plenty of energy to tackle this because we'll need so we have one coat on the tile um, we have two coats here, which actually looks pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. Um, I got a good tip from you guys saying to leave these on until you put the new ones on, which actually was crazy good helpful. Um, but yeah, we're gonna let this sit tonight and see what tomorrow brings us because I'm exhausted. And that deliciously turned down bed is waiting for me. So I will see you guys in the morning and we have so much more to, <laughs> to do tomorrow. You wanna say hi, Mims? Enzo? Enzo? Oh, we're only getting cat butts tonight. All right, that means time for bed. See you guys in the next video. Bye. <laughs>